Stuart is recognised as the SNP Parliamentary Group's lead spokesperson on asbestos issues. Shortly after being elected, Stuart was contacted by Scotland's leading anti-asbestos charity, Clydeside Action on Asbestos. They wanted his help to overturn a House of Lords decision, which restricted who could seek damages for being negligently exposed to asbestos. Initially, Stuart raised the issue in the Scottish Parliament and was prepared to take this forward as a member's bill. However, his lobbying of the Scottish Government saw them take it forward as a government bill. This was a significant victory for those with asbestos diseases in Scotland, as the UK Government failed to pass similar legislation in the rest of the country. Stuart has continued to campaign with and support Clydeside Action on Asbestos, attending their support group in Greenock and inviting former First Minister Alex Salmond to the launch of their charity badge. In recognition of his work on asbestos issues, Stuart was awarded an honorary life membership of Clydeside Action on Asbestos. Stuart's current campaign is to help the NHS recover the costs of treating those who have been negligently exposed to asbestos. With support from Clydeside Action on Asbestos and Thompson solicitors, Stuart has brought forward a member's bill which could lead to a £20 million windfall for Scotland's NHS. At the present time, The insurance industry who would be liable under this legislation are formulating an alternative option. This would still see additional funding coming to Scotland's NHS, but without the threat of lengthy legal action. Stuart is currently in negotiations with the insurance industry on this issue.